me an instrument of thy peace. Lord, make me an instrument of thy peace. Let the voice smell get it. <laughs> Where there is hatred, let me sow love. Where there is injury, pardon. You know, I've been getting these calls lately saying, please hold for an important message. So naturally, I hang up immediately. But last night, I let curiosity get the best of me, and it turned out to be American Express. And my bill was overdue. Uh, the man was extremely nice. He said it was an honor to assist me, and he asked if I would stay on the line to do a quick service reading. And since he was doing such a great job all the way from India, I decided I'd stay on the line for about five more minutes, and I had no time to meditate. So, for there is darkness, light, he's hurt. Where there is sadness, joy. No. What if it isn't American Express? What if it's something important? <coughs> Hello? No, I would not like a lower rate on cable TV. I like paying the higher rate. Thank you so much. <laughs> Are you getting dressed, baby? I'm dressed. Get dressed, Jesse. Whatever, dude. He's 11. And by the way, I'm keeping him off stage because, well, I don't believe the stage is a particularly healthy place for a child. <laughs> Besides, the, no one wants to see a child on stage unless he's singing show tunes. Where? My husband designs crash tests. I'm leaving, Jess. Be in the car. Hold on. You know, I thought of doing this as a one-woman thing once, but I couldn't get them out of my head. I could not get them quiet enough. Well, I could get him out of my head sometimes. <laughs> Love you. Love you, bye. Our parent-teacher conference was seven weeks ago. That's what clued us in that there was a problem in the first place, and that's what we decided not to call. Not we. I decided to call Dr. Zavala. Could you be the teacher now, so we right now? Yes, like, like Windows. Could you just minimize sure. stuff? Yeah. Mm. Well, he hates doing the work. He hates reading. He hates writing, and he hates math. But I think he may just be anxious. We're trying to find out what he's interested in, but he doesn't seem to be interested in anything. But the next morning, I go for a job to keep my endorphins up. And I noticed my next door neighbor is eating a whole bag of donuts in her car. But she's just had a gastric bypass, and I don't want to embarrass her, so I don't say anything. But a moment later, she comes out. Hi! Hey, Sherry. I'm so dusty. I'm riding this for You got really fast on this bicycle. But before I can make an excuse about having to go home and finish that design plan, our other neighbor comes out. Can Henry have a play date with Jesse today? Gee, I'm afraid not, Vera. How come? I want to say he's out of the country, but he has a special after-school class. What's he taking? Magic. Well, how about tomorrow? Henry's much better. He doesn't play. Oh, oh great! <laughs> What's he taking now? The next week, we go to our doctor, Daniel Broder, who has known Jesse all his life. Now, Daniel's not only an MD, but he's also a homeopath. Basically, the whole idea of homeopathy is that everybody has a certain key to them. So when you take this remedy or this key to you that actually tastes a lot like sugar in the form of a teeny tiny pill, it's like all of the symptoms that are occurring you will fall away and you will be you. You'll be well. Well, well for you. Hi. <laughs> How's it going? <laughs> <laughs> but doesn't it hurt? Uh, I don't know, I just, I feel kind of numb. And after I do it, I feel normal again. And then it heals. Uh-huh, and when you, when you take the scabs off, it's like you get to do it all again. Like, taking a piece of yourself off. Like, shedding. 
shoes. Have you ever bought shoes off the internet? No. Well, I just started buying mine from Zappos.com. I get a little overwhelmed with malls, especially with the parasol. And even if you can't afford a mortgage anymore, you can always afford shoes. <laughs> Zappos.com. I scan their selection for about an hour and I end up buying seven pairs of shoes because this is a lot more fun than, well, my life. But while I'm on the net, I decide to Google ADD and there are millions of sites, uh, more sites than there are shoes on Zappos. So I call Dr. Zavala.